Hi guys, it's me Swastik and in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to work with Intense. So let's start. Intense are a new feature in Discord.py version 1.5. If you haven't already updated your Discord.py module, you should do it. The way to do it is simply pip install Discord.py and these hyphens and upgrade. Once you run it, it will update Discord.py to the latest version. And once you're done with that, you can open your Discord developer portal. So just go to discord.com slash developer slash applications. This is the bot that I'll be enabling Intents for. So just click on your bot and go to the bot section in the settings and scroll down to Privileged Gateway Intents. So there are basically two Privileged Gateway Intents for now. The first is Presence Intent and the second is Server Members Intent. Presence Intent allows your bot to track uh, presence data, which is simply just the statuses of the users. So for example, if you have a user info command that gives the author the info about a user's status, if they're online or idle, etc or even their presence, like the game they're playing. This should be on, so just turn it on. And the server member's intent is very important. It gives your bot access to the server members and also some events like on guild join, etc. So you should probably turn this on. This is very important. And once it's done, you can click on save changes. And after that, we can move to our code. So the major change that we have to make is simply just adding a parameter inside of commands.bot intents equals discord dot intents with i capital dot all this gives the bot access to each and every intent and if you want to do it this way it's fine it's just in one line you could also get specific intents for that just make a variable with intents equals discord dot intents dot default instead of all you'll just have the default ones once you have that, you have intents dot members. So let's say you only want the server members intent, turn this on. So, and then just pass in intents inside of this. So this is another way of doing it. You can use this way as well. Or if you want all intents, you can just have discord.intents.all. If you have any doubts or questions about intents, you can visit the docs here. I'll provide the link in the description below. If you still have doubts, you can join the server in the description below and ask your doubt in the help section. And that's it. It was a short video today, but uh, this is very important because after some time, Discord will discontinue the older versions. So you should probably make these changes as soon as possible. Okay, thanks for watching. And if you like the video, hit the like button and subscribe. And I'll meet you in the next one. Goodbye.